Hi, welcome to a new WIMPACT tutorial. On this video, we'll see how to verify the communication between a server and a client machine. When troubleshooting a client-server communication, check the following settings. First, make sure there are no firewalls activated. To do this, go to Control Panel, then go to System and Security, and there you will see the option that says Windows Firewall. Once you're here, at your left, select Turn Windows Firewall on or off. Make sure everything is off, and then click OK. Once the firewall is disabled, check the communication between your client and your server. Open a command prompt and try to ping the IP address of the server from the client. It should reply successfully. Try this also from the server to the client. If both pings are successful, then test the communication between your client and the server through ports 5555 and 5556 with the teller command. It's common you'll receive the following reply when you first attempt the Telnet command. We need to enable it on the Windows features. To do this, on your keyboard, hit Windows and letter R at the same time and type in Optional Features, no spaces, and click OK. A new window will come up. And there you will scroll down until you see the option that says Telnet Client. Make sure it's checked and then click OK. Once the changes are applied, test the Telnet command again. Unfortunately, this also failed. This indicates that the ports might be closed or there's something else blocking the communication through these ports. So we'll need to check on the network what else could be causing this problem. In the case this ports were open, what we would see with the talent command would be a blank screen. At that point, the communication has been established and the client and the server are communicating properly. For more information and videos, visit our webpage https colon forward slash forward slash honeywelldiscovertraining.com